other for 21 years. Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland. Even with much cooler highs, only in the 70s today, it was still above normal. But that'll change as we move into September. Here's a look at your temp trend. We're going to see upper 60s to lower 70s tomorrow afternoon. Mid 70s return on Friday. And then as we head through the unofficial end to summer, Labor Day weekend, we're going to warm back up. We're going to be looking at highs well up into the 80s for Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. But of course, the big weather story today was the cool down. Temperatures this afternoon running a good 5 to 10 to almost 15 degrees cooler than what we saw yesterday afternoon when highs were in the mid to upper 80s. Right now we have temperatures that range from the upper 60s to the upper 70s. Wapaka still coming in at 78, but most spots are now in the lower 70s, including the Valley where it's 73 and Green Bay where it's also 73 and the dew point has dropped down into the 50s. So along with the thermometer dropping, the humidity has also been dropping as well. We had several days with dew points up into the upper 60s to mid 70s. That is considered oppressive, but this afternoon that dew point has now dropped back down into the 50s and it's going to stay there for the next four days. NBC 26 precision radar shows mainly dry conditions across northeast Wisconsin. Having said that, we do have a couple of showers and sprinkles moving across parts of Marinette County here just to the west of Wasaki and Cribbets. This activity is sliding off towards the south and east, so a couple of raindrops are possible, mainly to the north of Green Bay over the next couple of hours, but most spots will stay dry. The cold front that brought us the cooler weather is working off towards the south, but we have another upper level system that is moving through the area right now, producing some clouds and and a couple of sprinkles and it's going to reinforce the cooler weather as we head into tomorrow. We had highs in the mid 70s today, but up to the north high temperatures were only in the 60s and this is the time of year that we see that summer slide. We transition from summer to fall during the month of September. Our normal high tomorrow is 75 by the end of the month. Our normal high is in the mid 60s, but tomorrow some spots will only see highs in the mid to upper 60s. It looks like most of us will probably see upper 60s to lower 70s, which is below normal for the first day of September. Lots of clouds mixing with a few stars tonight. We'll see sun and clouds tomorrow morning and then a decent amount of sunshine as we wrap up today as high pressure builds in from the north. So your forecast for tonight calls for variable cloudiness. It's going to be a bit breezy as that next little system kind of works in from the north. During the overnight hour, temperatures will be dipping down into the lower 50s. Once again, a slight chance for a sprinkle or a shower. Tomorrow, breezy and cooler, upper 60s to lower 70s. Of course, tomorrow is the first day of school for most kids here in northeast Wisconsin. You can expect mostly sunny and cool conditions with temperatures in the 50s. So if they have that new pair of pants or maybe Maybe that light jacket they want to wear. They can actually wear tomorrow and be comfortable. My three degree guarantee for tomorrow is 71. If I can hit that high within three degrees, we will donate $100 to New Cap. We did that today. I forecast 76 and the actual high temperature was 76 degrees. As we move into Friday, we can expect even cooler conditions during the morning, mid to upper 40s. That means some upper 30s are possible way off to the north and west of the Fox Valley. Beautiful the weather then for Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Sunday as we warm up, we're going to see a lot of sunshine temperatures rebounding into the lower 80s by Sunday afternoon and then mid 80s for Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. We'll have a chance for a thunderstorm on Labor Day, mainly late, a better chance for thunderstorms on Tuesday and then even a better chance on Wednesday <laughs> as a cold front approaches from the west. Well, at least the cooler weather will make it easier for kids to go back to school. Yeah, it'll feel like fall. Yeah, if it was sunny in 85, I think it'd be tougher. They didn't want to. They wouldn't want to go. <laughs> no, they want to go to the pool. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Cameron. Yep. The Green Bay Packers are heading to Kansas City. Why